So guys, for the first step, you want to go to your Steam library and you want to find Billy Scholarship Edition. Now once you find it, you want to right click on it and then click on Properties and then click on Installed Files and then click on Browse. And now once this comes up, you want to find the bully.exe file. I'm going to scroll down till I find bully.exe. It should have the bully logo on it, the bully picture. Now once you find that, you want to right click on it and then click on Properties and then click on Compatibility. And now you want to select change high DPI settings. Now once you're on this, you want to select override high DPI scaling behavior. And you want to select application. And then click on OK. And then click on OK again. And we can now close out of this. For the next step, you want to go to the link which will be down below in the description to download the silent patch. And now once you're on this, you want to scroll down. And then click on download. Now once that's been downloaded, you want to right click on it and then click on show in folder. And now once we're here, you want to right click on the zip file and then click on extract all. You can untick this box and then click on extract. We should now have this folder right here, the silent patch with all these files right here. You want to copy all of these files. So just hover over it, right click and then copy. Now you want to go back to your Steam library and you want to find Billy. You want to right click on it and then click on properties, installed files, and then click on browse. You want to paste all those files into this folder. So you want to right click and then click on paste. We should now be seeing all these files right here. If you can't see the extension of the file like .dol, .asi, then you want to click on view and then click on show. Make sure that you have file name extensions ticked. You should now be seeing .asi, .asi, .txt, .dol, etc, .ini. You want to find silent patch bully .ini. Double click on it, make sure that it's .ini. Now once we're here, it's going to be saying FPS limits. You can set it to 60 if you want to. If you set it to above 60, this is going to speed up your game and it can cause some issues. So I recommend keeping it on 60. However, you can experiment if you want to, but for me personally, I'll keep it on 60 because you may run into some issues. And now you want to click on file and then click on save. And then close out of this. And we can now launch Bully. And now once we're on Bully, we can now go to the video tab and you can now set your resolution. For me, I made it 1920 by 1080. And you can do your other settings as well. And we can now go to story mode. And as you can see, I'm now on 60 FPS. And the game problems have been fixed. That's how you do it.